time to get up. I'm leaving for work. Ugh. I don't want to get up yet. I understand that it's for me to be productive and stuff, but I don't know why she put me in this kind of schedule, but I'll get up anyway. I hate getting up this early. It, it makes it so I have so much gunk in my eyes. Kitty. I love this kitty. We got him about five years ago for my sister. And she picked him because he was so pretty and fuzzy. And he's just so soft. I love his fuzz. It's so cuddly. The only bad part is that his fur gets everywhere and we can never wear any black clothes, especially all over my bed. That's the least best part. But either way, just cause of that fur, he's just so soft. I'll see you later, kitty. I gotta get downstairs and see what's going on. Ooh, there's my iPad. I better grab that. I can play games the entire day since I'm up so early anyway. Now, I'm not good at very many things, but it is definitely the only thing and best thing that I am at is definitely video games. My fingers, I, I can just play it so well. I can play games on my iPad forever. Things like Minecraft and all sorts of games like that. They, they do have a game called Pokemon Go, too. I, it's really f Wait. Who's that? I really don't want to have to answer the door, but I, I know I should anyway. It could be really important. And Mom would not be very happy with me, so I, I, I'll do it. I really hope it's not some stabber. Hi, I'm from vault -Tec. As I'm sure you're aware, vault -Tec is the main company in creating underground fallout shelters. Oh god, vaults, he's trying will, to, he's talking to me. I, I hope he knows that I can't These talk. These have luxury accommodations so you can wait out the nuclear devastation. In this briefcase, I have paperwork to get you set up for your vault. Is there an adult home? It really is of the utmost importance. No. My my mom's not here. She'll she'll be back at nine. All right. Well, can you let her know that I came by? It's really of the utmost importance. Like I said. Anyway, have a great day. I think I saw him walk away. So I'm just gonna check. But I I think the coast is clear. I think I saw him that way. But. I, I should be okay. I should be okay. I'm, I'm just gonna go for a little nature walk. This is an aspen. Do you want to know how I know that? Because it's the way it is. And that's pretty neat. Oh man, I, I can see mom. She's pulling in right now. I can't wait to see her, but I'm, I don't want her to take me to therapy. That's the last thing that I want. They're just gonna tell me all that's wrong with me. And I don't, I don't, I don't, I already know. Mom? Well, hi, Andy. Hey, what are you doing out here? Oh, I was, I was just looking at aspens, you know? Oh, okay. Well, we've got therapy. we got to get going uh, here. Yeah, that's, that's right. Uh, I, I guess let's, let's get going. Okay. She always tells me how it will help me and get, my, get me on a, the right path, but maybe someday it will. Therapy can be scary. My color is almost cherry. This task brings me dread, but 
but I'd prefer it to being dead. I know that there is still hope, and for that I know I can cope. But I am terrified that this cannot be set aside. No matter how much I can sigh, I need to finally build some pride, and someday I might have a bride. But now I'll step to confessions, that I know that I have depression. I know that it can be overcome, to not know that one must be dumb. But I don't want medication, and to do that would be sedation, for it mutes all form of creation. So I might as well hit a bus station, for a very much needed vacation. But I have autism, which is a different word for ostracism. And I know that it can be overcome, to not know that one must be dumb. But I have depression, and, this is, and there is my sermon and confession. I know that it can be overcome, to not know that one must be dumb. But therapy is scary.